If you have bought solar panels for your home or you're thinking or considering buying solar panels, then you need to watch this video. In this video, we put together 20 quiz questions that salespeople, sleazy salespeople that are going to sell you solar will use on you. So my name is George. Welcome to Go Green Hub, where we do everything that's good for the planet, including solar panels. Hey, here's your quiz which we hope will be your guide to the world of solar energy scams. What is the upfront cost homeowners should expect to pay for a residential solar panel system? Nothing, it's completely free, a small installation fee, or several thousand dollars. Several thousand dollars. How do some solar companies entice homeowners with free solar panel? by offering government subsidies, by including the cost in long-term financing agreements, by inflating the system's size and price. It's by including the cost in long-term financing agreements. You're paying for everything. What is a common tactic used by aggressive salespeople to pressure homeowners into signing contracts on the spot? Offering a limited time discount, claiming that rebates will expire soon or insisting on immediate decisions without allowing time for comparison. It's insisting to sign now immediately without comparison. How do some solar companies manipulate lease agreements to benefit themselves rather than homeowners? By including hidden fees and escalator clauses? By offering guaranteed energy saving? By providing maintenance repairs at no additional cost? They include hidden fees and escalator cause clauses. That's they get the money. What is a red flag when a salesperson promises guaranteed energy savings with solar panels? They provide a detailed analysis of energy usage and potential savings, or they refuse to provide written estimates or contracts, or they offer money back guarantees if they are not achieved. They refuse written estimates or contracts. What should homeowners be cautious of when a solar company insists on using their preferred financing partner? Lower interest rates and better terms, potential kickbacks or commissions for the salesperson, better customer service. Potential kickbacks and commissions for the salesperson. What is a deceptive practice some solar companies engage in to inflate system prices? Offering limited warranties on equipment, including unnecessary add-ons and upgrades or providing transparent pricing and contracts. It's including unnecessary add-ons and upgrades. What is a common tactic used by some solar companies to skirt regulations and permitting requirements? Partnering with reputable local contractors, offering cash incentives for bypassing inspections, or installing systems without proper permits. It's installing systems without proper permits. Watch out for that. How do some solar companies exploit federal tax credits to benefit themselves rather than homeowners? By passing the full credit savings to the homeowners, by inflating system prices to maximize credits, by providing accurate documentation and filling assistance, by inflating the system prices to maximize the credits. That's what they do. What is a deceptive practice that some solar companies engage in to lock homeowners into long-term contracts? Offer flexible payment options, including automatic contract renewal clauses, providing clear cancellation policies. It's include automatic contract renewal clauses. What is a common tactic used by some solar companies to overestimate potential energy production? providing accurate site evaluations and solar potential assessments, using unrealistic assumptions and sun hours estimate, or offering performance guarantees backed by insurance. It's using unrealistic assumptions and sun hour estimates. How do some solar companies manipulate financing agreements to hide long-term costs from homeowners? By offering transparent and straightforward financing terms, or include the hidden fees and escalating payments over time, or providing low interest loans with no hidden charges. It's including all the hidden fees and escalating payments over time. What is a red flag when a solar company insists on homeowners signing a power purchase agreement, PPA? P 
PPAs typically offer the best financing benefits for homeowners, or lack of transparency regarding electricity rates and escalations, PPAs provide homeowners with full ownership of the solar system. It's lack of transparency regarding electricity rates and escalations. How do some solar companies take advantage of homeowners with poor credit scores? They offer flexible payment plans with no credit checks, charge higher interest rates and fees, provide financial assistance programs for low-income households. <laughs> they, they charge higher interest fees and rates, of course. What is a deceptive practice some solar companies engage in to inflate system performance claims? By providing accurate data from independent testing laboratories, by using unrealistic energy ratings and exaggerate production estimates, or by offering performance guarantees with compensation for underperformance. It's by using unrealistic efficiency ratings and exaggerated production estimates. How do some solar companies exploit homeowners by claiming to be affiliated with government agencies or programs? By offering genuine incentives and rebates endorsed by local authorities, by using deceptive marketing tactics to imply government affiliation, or by providing accurate information about available tax credits and incentives. It's by using deceptive marketing tactics and to imply government affiliation when that's not true. What is a common tactic used by some solar companies to avoid providing written contracts or agreements? They offer detailed contracts with transparent terms and conditions, or by using verbal promises and agreements with no documentation, or providing clear cancellation policies and a refund guarantee. It's by using verbal promises and agreements without any documentation. What is a red flag when a solar company claims to offer exclusive discounts or limited time offers? The discount clearly outlined in the initial quote, pressure tactics to rush homeowners into quick decisions, but the company has a history of genuine promotional events. It's pressure, high pressure, to rush homeowners into quick decisions. How do some solar companies take advantage of language barriers or lack of understanding among homeowners? They provide clear and concise explanations of products and services by using technical jargon and complex contracts to confuse the homeowners, offering multilingual support and educational materials. You guessed it, using technical jargon and complex contracts to confuse everybody. What is a deceptive practice some solar companies engage in to avoid honoring warranties or guarantees? They offer extended warranty coverage at no additional cost, include clauses that void warranties under common circumstances, or providing prompt repairs and replacements for faulty equipment. It's including clauses that void warranties under common circumstances. Remember, knowledge is power and you are now better equipped to navigate the world of solar energy without falling prey to scams. Stay vigilant, stay informed, and stay sunny.